The Alpha Mine Resistant Ambush Protected Vehicle was jointly developed by Protected Vehicles Incorporated and Oshkosh Trucks Corporation. It was first publicly revealed in 2006. This MRAP was marketed by Oshkosh. PVI was responsible for production of armored hulls while Oshkosh provided production capability, engineering expertise and possibly automotive components. It is worth mentioning that PVI also developed another Golan MRAP in cooperation with Raphael of Israel. The U.S. Marine Corps placed an initial order for 100 Alpha MRAPs. However later it was announced, that there will be no further orders due to insufficient survivability and other fundamental design flaws. This vehicle had to be significantly redesigned to get more orders. However since 2007 the protected vehicles incorporated was in a state of bankruptcy. It seems that Oshkosh also stopped marketing this vehicle. This vehicle is a Category I MRAP. By its weight and size it is referred as a mine-resistant utility vehicle. Its primary role is urban operations and patrol missions. It was designed specifically for asymmetric warfare, where mines, improvised explosives and ambushes are likely to be encountered. The Alpha is aimed at the up-armored HMMWV replacement market. Also this MRAP was competitively priced. The Alpha MRAP has a lightweight composite armor. It offers better protection than steel armor, but weights 37% less. It is worth noting that PVI was known for their advanced armor technology. It is claimed that front arc of this vehicle withstands hits from 12.7mm rounds. All round protection is against 7.62mm armor piercing rounds. The Alpha MRAP can also be up armored. Add-on armor capability was considered from the outset. Add-on armor modules can be fitted in field conditions. Vehicle also has a V-shaped hull, which provides protection against landmines and eye blasts. This mine-resistant vehicle can be armed with roof-mounted 7.62mm or 12.7mm machine gun or 40mm automatic grenade launcher for self-defense. The Alpha MRAP accommodates up to 8 passengers. Troops enter and leave the vehicle via rear doors. In case of overturning or emergency occupants leave the vehicle via roof hatches. There are some firing ports provided for the troops. This mine-resistant vehicle is fully air-transportable.